Have you come to watch, Odin? <laughs> yeah, I would want to watch you too, Clive. Bound for stone here. Good. My master awaits you in the capital. Though I cannot allow you to attend him in your present state. Huh? And how are you going to stop us? Why, with this! Wait! <gasps> Wait a second. Wait, is that from the red fucking dot in the sky? Is that what that was what from? What do you do? If the vessel would see the path opened, it has but to ask. I shall see that my master's prize is made presentable. Galloping or anything, he's uh, on air. Clive, would you mind telling me what the fuck just happened? I don't know. <sighs> hey, they just turned into oh, feathers. You've got to be. How are we supposed to get through that? We don't. We seek an audience with the king. If his majesty wants me to come and ask him, then that is exactly what I'll do. Before you go practicing your petition, we don't even know where the fucker went. How about we cool our heads and think this through, eh? Um... All right. Go to my YouTube. Go to my YouTube channel and click join. And then that way when we do the YouTube stream, you guys can have the emotes. Please only do it if you're willing and able and you really want to though. I hope you guys know there's never any pressure. I go to that door, right? Okay. Are they gonna like Why? pop up and Start killing me? Or are they dead? The blade must ever feed if her edge is to remain keen. Butcher. What care you for these worthless creatures? They are nothing. Weak from the moment of their conception, ever longing for power not theirs to command. They turn unfailingly upon themselves. Like sheep, they roam in filthy flocks, eager to trample those few gifted a fleece of gold. Or that they might feel contentment with their pitiful existence. Prejudice and persecution, severance and strife, every earthly wrong springs from the malice in men's hearts. Malice born of the what are you pain going on and about? suffering that is free will. Its corruption is gnawed at your being from the very moment of your birth. 
They're just no, mad because you're the ugly version of me. It is no corruption. It is who I am. Every choice I make, right or wrong, gives me reason to carry on. And carry on I shall. Not as a puppet, but as a man. Which are you? <laughs> there was a time I too thought those the only choices. What? Long ago, God granted man the gift of magic. And with that gift did he build great civilizations. Yet over time, man lost sight of the gift's true meaning, stepping from the path of shared prosperity to one of avarice. He abandoned his creator for sword and flame, and through his folly, beckoned the blight. Yet, there were those few who refused to turn their eyes from the heavens, and they prayed to God that he might lead them back to righteousness. And the Lord, he did answer. Before the worthy shall the gates of paradise open, and so did I spread my arms to the ether, and cast my soul upon its gentle waters. I gave myself unto him. Okay. I knew it. Are they gonna come alive? Are they, are you? Oh, never mind. <laughs> okay. I see now. What madness is this? I think he has a big sword to well, compensate well, for something that. else. The Lord charged me thus. I don't know. If your kind are to find salvation, they must be made to serve. You see, paradise lies but a single step away. Could we only take it? Could we only leave our transgressions behind? For none save the pure of heart and mind may set foot in the new world. I will save us. But it all begins and ends with you. You are the key, Mythos. And with this humble offering, shall I prove my faith once more. Offering? So you forsook your kingdom. You forsook yourself to serve. Tell me, how is that living? Yeah. What you seek to provide is not salvation. It's anything but. Life is about always having a choice. Take that away, and we might as well be dead. <laughs> You're literally the only one laughing right now, bro. Welcome back, Wheel. Thank you, Salt Snake. Thank Very you. Well. Come then. Show us the strength of your will. It's not the strength of my will that should worry you, but the weakness of yours. <laughs> oh my God. Chill. If you think your will the stronger, prove it. By this day's end, you Where shall you know of 
a god. Yet still you fight like a man. funny to me. your back on the truth, Barnabas. We are not as weak as your God believes. Oh my god, that was 
sister. Damn it. Yikes. You are not the fool I took you for. That's what I've been trying to tell you, stupid ugly. And so it ends. No. What? <laughs> Wait a second. <laughs> Don't tell me you are tired, Mythos. Your stubborn defiance has stirred my long becalmed heart, filling it with a joy that I have not known for generations! I had thought the tantalizing kiss of self-indulgence a dream forever out of reach! And now that its sweet ruin courses through my veins, I shall not be quick to relinquish it. Show me your words. Why is he getting those weapons? And I might revel in it. Oh, no. 
heal again. Oh god! <laughs> Scares me so bad. Oh, what the? Well, the day is at an end. And we both know the truth. <laughs> that the Clive it made is up. I who stand victorious. My will that prevailed. Your will? Hi, Joseph. How are you? No. It was his. Clive Rossfield. <laughs> oh, oh <laughs> these slow motion scenes are so good. Dang, he's gonna fall. He's gonna fall from all the way up there. Good luck with that. That's right, baby. Let's go. You're dead, bitch. Um, what's up, Rainbow? Hi, Axel. Go, Nikki, go! I was going, I was zooming, I was chopping his fucking face. I gotta stretch out my hand after that. That was craziness. <laughs> Torgo walking in like, yeah, that's right. That's my daddy. Me too, Torgo. Me too. <laughs> Not him coughing like Joshua. Perhaps there is strength in will. Would that I had not relinquished my own. <laughs> You relinquish nothing. What was it, if not will, that made you strive for a new world? Strive to win your master's approval? I... You were shown a fantasy, and you chose to believe it. But you were wrong. There is no world, but the one we live in. And that world, that world is worth saving, even if it means killing a god. Damn. Do it, Clive. Uh, Excuse me. <laughs> I promised that I would make you presentable, did I not? We shall fulfill our destinies just as the Lord's Mother Crystals have fulfilled theirs. Come, Clive Rossfield. Take what is rightfully yours. Become one with God. No. Oh, God! <laughs> it was 
is fine. At long last, salvation. I'm coming home. That was a dramatic ass death. I was looking at his booty. <laughs> He's so scary looking. Face me! How does it feel to ah! consume your rival's strength? To gorge yourself on their being? To edge step by trembling step ever closer to the divine? With or without a will, you are still but a vessel. Our vessel. Behold. How your body shudders in anticipation of its fate. Oh no. <laughs> oh. It's not yours yet. No. Come then, O oh wayward child. We shall await you upon the back of the first worm. There, all shall end, and begin again. No, I'm good, thanks. I feel you. We did it! Tina's <laughs> That's so true. Oh my god, you're so right. Also, hi, Rainbow. I don't even know if I said hi to you. My bad. Hello. Oh, shit, that scared me. Thank you for the follow. Run! Oh, no. Indeed. <laughs> the enemy numbers 200,000 or more counting yours. There are simply not enough soldiers counting in the capital to repel an army of that size. Then, one of the central keep, held by a contingent of soldiers and bearers from the surrounding boroughs. They are the sole reason it still stands. And all it took was an army on their doorstep to bring them together. The prospect of death does put things into perspective. <laughs> Perspective. Perhaps it's what we've lacked all along. I 
need you to lend me some of your best men. Preferably all of them. My best men? Does it look like I'm anyone? I admit this might not be the most convenient time, but my nephew's in trouble. And I may have already promised him more help. Your nephew, the outdoor. My soldiers have better things to do than die for nothing. And you and he are of the same mind. I fight for the opposite. He fights for a world in which he shouldn't have to live and die for nothing. And, and he fights today to give us all the chance of a better tomorrow. Be that as it may, a handful of men cannot stand against the kingdom. This is a really interesting time for them to be having this conversation. Wait, what? Then mayhap they are the wrong men. Well, I'll be damned. Wow. Our numbers His are. His hot few. ass just strolled in. I shall here. rally as many of my dragoons as I'm able. You, apprise the Lord Strategist of the state of the city's defenses. Yes, Your Radiance. And you would fight alongside us. I owe the Phoenix a debt. <laughs> Does this vouch for my nephews? Aye, but I still have my doubts about you. Which we can discuss later. Indeed. You said you had men garrisoned in the keep. Captain! Do you know how many yet remain? Allow me to confirm. Commander? Whatever their number, Randalar will be needing Gather the them the bodies all. and build a pyre in the courtyard. Quickly. Terence. My lord. What's up, you Eric? How you doing? doing? A girl. We are in the middle of a war. I owe her my life, and I always pay my debts. You are to see that she is provided for. Dion, I cannot leave. But you shall. If I am ever to be worthy of the forgiveness of our people, then I must earn it. And I must earn it by my hand, and my hand alone. Oh no. I cannot ask this lightly. <laughs> One of them gonna I know die. That I will do it. Farewell, Terence. Good, Eric. How are you doing? Welcome in. Some time later. Clive, thank fuck. You were right. They were just waiting the whole time. But I'm a damn sight better for seeing you, Joshua. And Barnabas. The king is dead. That's right, baby. <laughs> that is fuck. So. Oh, there. There. Oh.
They are, but so is their killer. He can't hurt anyone anymore. You safe. Wiener? The fu Why are you putting wieners in my chat? Why not? Oh, okay. Need to talk. <laughs> Let me see your wieners. Not actually, I was just kidding. <laughs> oh my god, I just looked over at the Paul Red prayer candle. You know, I want nothing more than to go with you. I do. But I'm glad you're heading back to the Enterprise, nonetheless. And not just for Edda's sake. Our people need to know what <laughs> I'm happened I'm sorry, here. guys. I'm so you can sorry. Count on me. As can she, I hope. Thank you, me lords. That is something to be grateful wise? for. Wiser than leaving a woman with child alone in the Deadlands. They'll be safer at the hideaway. For now, at least. This land is overrun with Akashic. The king himself was long turned, albeit by choice. All to serve Ultima in his damnable quest to forge the perfect vessel. The chaos Barnabas wreaked upon nation after nation. How many were killed for this? Ah. Oh, he didn't consider it killing. Or a mercy of sorts. A way to end their suffering. He truly wanted to save mankind, and ultimately use that. As he uses us. But why us? What are we? What are we? We are dominance. That is our fate. Oh, okay. But that doesn't mean we have to accept it, which is why we fight. For the right to deny it. Is that huh? not so? Oh! I have the alerts muted. <gasps> Hi, Sky! Oh, Thank you for the raid! Oh, thank you! I hope you had a fun stream. What were you doing tonight? Welcome in, everybody. Something else. I'm watching these men go through the a moment. Crystals were ultimus. Hi, everybody. Ultimus. Welcome in. Hello, so hello. If you guys are new here, my name is Nithical. You know that the Mother Crystals have been... And I'm playing Final Fantasy 16 for my first time, and I'm pretty close to the end, so... We also know that it's this which hastens the spread of the blight. This mirror was unshaking. That was weird. But what I cannot fathom is what Ultima stands I'm gonna scroll up in chat so I can make sure I say hi to all of you in a second. Hi, 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 hi. Thank you for being here. Hello, hello, what hello. you find at the stronghold? The truth about Ultima's prize. I don't want to miss anything crazy. For so long, I believed it to be you. And you alone. Yet, it is not merely a freak that he desires, but a freak and Phoenix both. That which we became in the skies over Twinside. Yeah, they combined. Only when the twin flames are joined, shall his vessel be complete. Quite why he needs a vessel. It is another question. Unless there is something he cannot achieve without one. Something his immaterial form precludes. Something requiring an unthinkable amount of ether and a body resilient enough to channel it. If I did not know better, brother, I would think that he meant to cast a spell 
What's up, Matthews? Nuchu, hello, a spell Ninja. A years in the making. A spell to end all spells. And he cannot do it without us. Nor We've been without set up. Crystals. But if we destroy them all, we will stop not only the blight, but Ultima as well. Hi, Skittles. We stick to the plan then. You were playing Baldur's Maybe Gate 3? Time, you were playing balls in your Gate 3? Together. Well, it's a long walk to stone here. That's okay, we got chocobos. Let's not keep Ultima waiting. Hi, Julian. <sighs> Night.